making lace stitches. I'm really enjoying it this for the summer. So this is called Prism Stitch. It's a multiple of four plus two. This is a number four yarn and I'm using the needles that the yarn calls for. So these are number eight knitting needles. So what you want to do with this is row number one you're going to pass the first stitch as if to knit and knit the whole row. So easy. And this is very nice for a summer blouse or to put something over your bathing suit. There we go. And then row number two, you passed your first stitch as if to knit and purl the whole row. This would also look nice for like a little girl's dress. It would look so cute. So you purl the whole row. And the last stitch you are going to knit. There we go. So row number three. You're going to pass the first stitch as if to knit and then knit two stitches together. Yarn over, pass one stitch, knit the next and the one that you passed goes over that one that you knitted last. So let's do that again. You're going to knit two together, yarn over, pass one stitch, knit the next, and pass the past stitch over the last one. Again, you're going to knit two together, yarn over, pass one stitch, knit the next, and pass that one over. And then again, knit together, yarn over, pass one stitch, knit one stitch, and pass that one over, and then the last stitch you're going to knit. Okay, so row number four, you are going to pass the first one as if to knit, and then you're going to purl one, and that one that was the yarn over from the row before, that strand there, you are going to purl and knit that strand. So you are going to go there and purl, put your yarn in the back and knit it. Now you can take it off and purl. So that's the repetition. Let's do that again. You are going to purl one and then that strand you're going to purl without taking it off your left hand needle. Put your yarn in the back and knit it and then purl. So let's do that again. You purl and that strand you're going to purl and knit and then the next one you purl Again, you're going to purl and then that strand you purl, put your yarn in the back and knit it. Now you can take it off and then purl. And then the last stitch you knit. Okay, I already did row number five which I passed one as a to knit and then knitted the whole row and then row number six you pass one as a to knit you purl the whole row and then the last stitch you knit 
So let's do row number seven now. And it is pass one as if to knit and then yarn over. You pass one, knit one, and that one you pass over the last one and then knit two together. So let's repeat that, yarn over, pass one, knit one, and pass that one over and knit two together. Again, yarn over, pass one, knit one, pass that one over the last one and knit two together. Now yarn over, pass one, knit one, pass that one over and knit two together. And then you end with yarn over and knit one. So row number eight, you're going to pass that one as if to knit and then you're going to purl that one purl the next two and then that yarn over the same you're going to purl put your yarn in the back and knit and then purl purl that strand you're going to purl and knit so let's repeat that again. We're going to purl two. That strand you're going to purl and knit. And then purl the last four you're going to purl. One, two, Three. No, the last one you're going to knit. That one you're going to knit. So purl three and knit one. And that's it. Look how pretty that looks. So this is a very, very nice stitch. Thank you very much for watching and please share us with your friends and like our page and subscribe. And uh, until the next time.